So just a little update on the video. As you can see, we're stuck on the motorway right now. There's a little issue with the 240, unfortunately. The bolts have actually came off the wheel. So that's the damage here. 40 spaces. video for you today more transform here we're here with a special m240i and the guy's name is Chris uh, Chris we're here today with your car why don't you tell us a little bit about your car so it was stock about two days ago um, I've got a blue spark tuning box put in it's running about 420 brake and about 615 newton meters um, got the M performance wing mirrors basically off eBay but I'm going to be changing them fairly soon um, I've got 20 mil spaces front which may be a bit of a push but it works so I'm just going to keep going with it nice stance, um, yeah. 20 mil rear uh, this this really transforms it it it's, tends to get leery quite often um, with the spaces on I've, I've, I figured when they were standard it wasn't wasn't really getting much traction. Uh, it was getting too much traction, sorry. Right, so I put the spaces on. Um, obviously widened the track and it completely transformed the handle. I mean, it goes around corners really well. But um, when you put the spaces on, you widen it and it tends to kick out a bit more. Um, right. Got the M Performance tips. These were, I think these are genuine actually. Um, um, these are the carbon fibre tips, yeah? Yeah, carbon fibre. Uh, this needs to get blacked out, the M240 badge, yeah. but apart from that, I don't think there's anything else. Are you, are you thinking about getting a spoiler in your car maybe? Yeah, M2 pump spoiler, getting rid of that, that looks dreadful. Um, got the carbon fibre wing mirror tip, uh, sorry, the, the shark fin. Shark fin, yeah. yeah it's a nice size. Um, that's really that was from yourself, that was supplied. Supplied by Mark Transform, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, really nice. Interior wise, I've basically just got a stock, stock interior, um, but the carbon, um, not carbon, sorry, gloss black uh, paddle shifters, they really they do look good. Paddle shifters by, by some more transform as well. Yeah, and um, they're, they're nice. I'm looking to go for a carbon interior as well, and I think after that, Lauren Springs M3 control arms and that's it. So, right. and then a lot of package. Oh, very good. And then in terms of tuning, I know it's a stage one. Yeah. But how far are you looking to actually push this car? Stage two, and I think once you get past stage two, I mean it's just too much power. It's, mm -hmm. It struggles stock to get power down, but mm -hmm. I mean 420 brake and 600 odd newton meters. You, you really got to fight with it. Mm. Um, it's a lot for the road, isn't it? Yeah, yeah I, I don't turn traction fully off. It's, I mean, you'd slide it in Sport Plus and it's, it's fine like that, but DSA off now, you'd stack it instantly. Mm -hmm. Well, if you're a bad driver. I see. But, uh, right. well, the last step now is for us to go for a drive. Yeah, definitely.
it looks, it it looks crazy, like, but I haven't seen one in person. Everyone says it. We said the same thing about the M3 and M4s. We said I that I hated the grills at the start. I couldn't stand the grills, but now it's one of the cars that I want to get. Very similar speeds, but I think it's more consistent with the, the actual one three. Yeah. It's more aggressive. Yeah, you feel when it digs in. I found it more yeah. like just digs in and Thank <laughs> you. 